Today's video will talk about the element of art called shape. A shape is a two-dimensional area that is defined in some way. This means that we know where the edges are of this area based on either an outline, a change in value, or a change in color. Also, a change in texture can tell you where the edge of a shape is. Shapes can be recognizable objects, geometric or organic. Uh, in the boxes on your note packet, you're just going to be filling in the drawings. You do not have to fill in any of the words. So as I mentioned, there are two different types of shape, either geometric or freeform. Geometric shape are those ones that you've been seeing in math class for years and years, your circle, square, and triangle. These are regular and man-made, meaning that there are rules that regulate how you create them. A square has to have four equal sides. A circle has to be 360 degrees. A triangle has to have three sides with 180 degrees inside of them. There are rules that organize how you create these shapes. The other side of that is free form. These are called amorphous and organic. Uh, an amorphous shape is just a blob, a paint splatter, a cloud shape. All of those are amorphous. They morph into each other. There's fluidness to them. Organic, if you think like the grocery store, these are outlines of living things. So the example on the screen, the apple or the outline of a cat, think silhouette type shapes. Just a little reminder, geometric means man-made. These are not created naturally. Um, and amorphous and organic are found in nature. And that's it for shapes.